Welcome back to Sous Vide Everything, guys. It has been over a year that I do not cook a brisket, and today is brisket time. Let's do it. For today's cook, I'm using this beautiful 20 pounds brisket. I am going to be removing quite a bit of the fat, so let's do it. The only thing that you're limited with sous vide is your bag, so you must make sure that your brisket will fit inside of your bag. For my rub, I'm gonna keep it pretty simple using salt, pepper, and garlic powder. Remember, exact amount in the description down below. Now she's ready for the smoker. I'm gonna be smoking this at 145 degrees Fahrenheit for three hours, and I'm using mesquite wood. I'm gonna be cooking this beautiful brisket at 140 degrees Fahrenheit for 44 hours. We are ready, and the brisket is ready. Let's do it. Guys, it looks absolutely fantastic. It looks great, it smells even better. But here's the deal. It has been a while that I didn't cook a brisket, an entire year, and today is a brisket anniversary on the channel. And it has also been a while that I do not use the Searing Series Champion, and I think we should just go for it, Mama. What do you think, Mama? Let's do it. Yeah, I think we gotta do it. You know what's about to happen. It's about to go down right now. Let's do it. Ninja, how does it look, bro? Dang it, man. Wow, isn't that the most beautiful looking brisket? The smell, guys. <laughs> wow. So this is a piece of art in here, man. <laughs> this is this is beautiful just to look at. You don't want to eat it. You but just... I'm so hungry. I know. No, I want to eat it. You want to eat I it? I want to eat it. <laughs> Let's cut it open. No more talking. Let's do it. Let's go. Then test. Look at that. I think I just want to admire and not eat it. What about you? No, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna take care of it. All right, Ninja, no more talking. Let's dig in, my brother. Let's go for it. Ooh, that is a juicy brisket. Wow. How do you explain this? I don't know how to describe this one. That bark is so nice. <laughs> it's so tender. It's juicy, it's beefy. Look at the color of the ring, look at that. Got a smoke ring going on. Man, this, this thing is... 
Wow. Yeah, nice. The tip is normally pretty dry. Not in this case, guys. It is fantastic. Not in this case, guys. This is awesome. This section is supposed to be dry. Normally, whatever you go to a restaurant, no matter what kind of restaurant it is, it's, wow. it's dry. This is so juicy right now. Look at this. It is indescribable. I, I, I have a good description for it. Mm. It's delicious. <laughs> when Google was cutting, you couldn't tell, but like, like Ninja said, the smoke ring is perfect right Move here. it a little bit towards the light. It looks fake. Like flip. It's so good that it looks fake. It looks fake. It looks fake. It looks like somebody <laughs> painted it. It's amazing. Ninja, that is not fake. I know it's not fake. Mm. Wow. In the bark. Ah. Isn't the bark amazing, Momo? Mm. I don't even want to chew. I just want to lick everything. <laughs> What do you have to say about licking uh, brisket? I don't know. Uh, it's, you know, it's my mouth. What'd you do with the bark? This bark is incredible. Isn't it? Flamethrower, my mouth. You like the bark, huh? Ninja, I know they're gonna get mad at us if we don't try the fatty part, Ninja. The best part of the brisket, because I'm, I'm happy gonna, with I, this. I'm gonna get mad at you if you don't try it. Ninja, I, they want us to try on camera. They just wanted to, you know, I'm happy with this, but we gotta try it. Oh, that, that's awesome. Oh, Lord. That's it. Which one is better? The flap or the point? <laughs> oh. mm. <laughs> wow. Both surrender. <laughs> I mean, mm. this is the perfect diet for somebody who had no teeth. <laughs> <laughs> you don't need to chew, man. Just put it oh in your mouth, God. move it around a little bit, and that's it. It's gone. Guys, I know we say this a lot. But this one is amazing and delicious combined together. Do you agree, Ninja? 110%. Yes, it's fantastic. I know you guys want me to describe the flavor. I will try because mm. it's indescribable. The bark is fantastic. It's kind of crunchy and kind of uh, beefy at the same time and smoky. Burn, a little bit char flavor and crunchy. The inside is perfectly seasoned. The smoke, you can taste the smoke. It's extremely oh, yeah. juicy. It is by far the best brisket I have ever cooked in my life. Do you agree? It's the best brisket I ever tried in my life. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber, be sure to subscribe for future videos. And remember, if you are interested in anything I use, everything is in the description down below. Thank you so much, and we'll see you guys on the next one. Take care. Love Bye. you. Now, I know what they're gonna ask me. Ah, how about smoke before or smoke after? They're gonna ask me that. Aren't that's, you gonna ask me that? They're gonna ask me that. That's great. That's, I, I think I think you're okay with that. We can make another one. <laughs> I know you guys are gonna ask me, should I smoke before or should I smoke after? What's the best way? You wanna see a video comparing both of them? Comment down below and let yeah. me know. Yeah, ah, please. <laughs> Mama mouth did not try the good part. Go for it, Mama. Tell us. Amazing! Delicious. People making lines outside of the office to come over here and eat this food, man. And uh, today I think we're gonna share because we have a lot of food in here. Oh yes, look at this. Oh Lord. Oh my goodness. Oh, and Mama? It's a lot of meat. And I'm gonna take a few steaks for Panchito, man. Panchito's your dog. You're gonna Panchito's give prime brisket. You're gonna give prime brisket to your dog? Yeah, I'm gonna cut it really thin for him. He's gonna love it. I don't know about that. My wife might get really mad because she wants some. See you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.